Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Riz and welcome to my channel. In today's quick and awesome video, I'm going to show you how you can screen your iPhone 13, any iPhone 13 by the way, to your TV. Okay, so if you have Android TV, this should work, but I'll be uploading a dedicated video for that, so be sure to subscribe, okay? Alright, so a couple of things before we start. It's completely free, it's wireless, and I'm going to show you two different ways you can screen mirror your iPhone 13 to your TV. So let's just dive right into it. All right, so the first thing we need to do on the iPhone, no matter what app you're using, is to make sure your iPhone is connected to your Wi-Fi. So just make sure your iPhone is connected to the Wi-Fi. All right, so the first app we're gonna be looking at is gonna be the Replica app. I'm not getting paid by these guys. I genuinely feel like this is one of the best screamering apps that I've used uh, over, the, over the time. So no IP addresses, no nothing. Once you open the app, it'll automatically show you all the TVs that are running in the background. So to make sure it works, we need to make sure the uh, TV is also, your TV is also on the same network, okay? So let's do that. So my iPhone is on the, uh, my home Wi-Fi, so we have to make sure the TV is also on the home Wi-Fi. So go to the settings, go to the network settings, and go to the network settings inside the network. That way you have the option to enable or disable the Wi-Fi and connect your TV to your home Wi-Fi. As you can see, mine is connected to my home Wi-Fi. That is pretty much it. By the way, this is not an Android TV, okay? All right, so once the TV is connected, open the Replica app and click on your TV. Every time you click on it, it's gonna ask you to buy it. But if you look at the top right corner, you have the option to escape it. It takes about eight seconds. You just wait for eight seconds and there you go. You can skip it. All you have to do is just click on the exit and uh, there you go. Now it's gonna ask you to start the broadcast. And all you have to do is click on the start broadcast, wait three seconds, and bam, we are connected. No IP addresses, no nothing. This is why I love Replica app. I genuinely feel like this is one of the best screen ring, free best screen, I mean, one of the best free screen ring apps I have used for my iPhone. And I've, I've been using it for as long as I actually remember. So it's it's still free, by the way. All you have to do is just wait eight seconds and that's pretty much it. You can watch YouTube. You can even listen to music if you want to. You can uh, you can watch videos. You can uh, view photos. You, can, you have a lot of options, by the way. You can even play games too. All right, so if you want to stop this, if you look at the top left corner, you have the option to stop the broadcast and that's it. Pretty simple, right? All right, so the second we have screen mirroring. Unlike the replica app, this is a tiny, tiny bit different, but it works just the same, okay? Once you open the app, once you open the app, you will see that it will ask you to buy it, but don't worry about it. If you look at the top right corner, you have the option to skip it, just like we did in the replica app. All you have to do is just skip it, and now you have a big, big red icon of mirroring. All you have to do is just click on it, and again, click on, again, that big red icon. Once again, of course. <laughs> so just click on it and it's gonna ask you for a TV. By the way, this ma this point doesn't matter what TV you select. As you see, I selected the wrong TV. So don't worry about it. Even if you select anything else, it works just the same, okay? So it's gonna ask you to start the broadcast. Just click on the st start the broadcast and that's pretty much it. Now, once you start the broadcast, it's gonna give you an IP address. As you can see on your screen, we have an IP address. You have to remember that, okay? You have to keep it running, and we need to place that IP address into any browser it's gonna work. It can be PC, it can be TV, or whatever you like. In this case, I do have a browser in my old Samsung TV, so just go to the Smart Hub and go to the open smart hub. Of course, this is old TV, by the way. If you have a better TV, this is gonna work much, much better, okay? So open the smart hub and go to the apps, all the apps. In this case, I do have a simple web browser, but again, if you have Chrome or a better browser, it's gonna work better. Trust me on this, okay? Once you open the browser, as you can see, it's really, really slow. I apologize about that. So once you open the browser, go to the uh, website and Type in the IP address we just uh, got from the uh, uh, from the app. As you can see, we have 192.168.1.37.8.80.88. So I want you to type that IP address. Gonna, it's a hassle, I know. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna I'm just gonna uh, speed up the process. Okay. So I'm just gonna type the address. Really simple. Nothing fancy. Just type in the address as is. Okay. Nothing fancy. 
as is. Just type in the address. Lost code is going to be the port. That's the port number, by the way. 8088. And once the IP address, and once you place the IP address, all you need to do is just press done. And uh, there you go. It's syncing. There you have it. Pretty, pretty simple. Unlike the Replica app, Replica app doesn't need, doesn't need the IP address, of course. So that's why I feel like Replica has edge over all the other apps that I'm, that I'm about to show you. So, uh, pretty simple there is a tiny bit of lag but as i said before if you have a better tv this is gonna work better i've tried it on a better tv it works better it's it's more smooth it's more hd so yeah the better the tv you have the better the quality you're gonna get so yeah it's pretty it's pretty pretty simple standard just like we uh, just like we saw before you have a lot of uh, you a lot of options again if you want to stop this really simple if you look at the top or left corner you have the option to stop the broadcast just like we did with the replica app and there you go Bam. that's it that's that's how you stop well i hope you enjoyed the video i hope you enjoyed the tutorial by the way if you have any questions you can use the comment section below or you can use the subreddit links will be in the description box below okay and if this video was helpful leave a like and subscribe as well and i'll catch you in the next one peace out